Hello folks, got some exciting news. I've uh, sold the bungalow, as in contract is signed, completion date for the 8th of October, and I've got myself an arrowboat. I've bought a 46 foot one, so it's uh, not as big as what I had it in mind originally, but I've taken the advice what everyone's given me and uh, I've decided to go for a little bit of smaller one uh, one what's going to give me plenty of room and um, it, because of the layout you know, uh, I knew when I saw it that it would be suitable and um, and it's going to, when I do eventually get on the canals on the cut, um, it will be easier to manoeuvre for, for one person. Because um, I don't think the lady who's here, she's not quite in the picture, uh, <laughs> that's my dog, uh, I don't think you'll be able to help, will you baby? No. You're just, just a little bit off the picture, aren't you? Yeah? Yeah? Come here, put your head over it. No? <laughs> no, she's tired, folks. She's an um, early riser like me, and uh, but she goes gets tired even before I do. Ain't you, Dicky? Yeah. So I've got a. It's a traditional uh, stern. Um, yeah. Okay. Different to what I originally planned for, but I liked the layout. I like the. Um, the easy access to get on the boat, uh, which will, I was thinking about with ladies, she, she, I didn't have any problem, she won't have any problem, will you baby? No. And uh, so I was happy with that. It's got lots of storage, lots of shelves, um, uh, all, all sorts of things. I'm going to share a few pictures. I did ask about video, but they didn't seem too happy about that at that stage. Um, so that will be at a later date, but uh, I'll share a few pictures what I took of the inside. It's one of the outsides, it's not a great one, but um, at least you can see what I've bought. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited. Um, deposit's been put down, and uh, so my next issue, uh, oh, and um, the um, uh, survey is going to be uh, sorted out as well and uh, obviously I'm not going to be able to get in there on that date um, depending on what the survey shows up there might be work what needs doing plus I'm going to want the boat blackening um, and also uh, I want a lot of solar put on the roof I've looked on the roof and there does uh, appear to be plenty of space but I'll leave that for the experts to fit in that for me. Um, I'm looking at maybe between a thousand and two thousand watt. I want to have plenty of uh, options open to me so I know I'm going to be marina base for you know I don't know how long for it depends with my uh, health and that, how long it takes me to recover from this long COVID. Uh, I've had it for 18 months and uh, it, it's, it's horrible. Um, so we'll see. I've forgotten what I was saying now. <laughs> uh, I don't cut the bits out, by the way, folks, so you get what you get. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, solar panels. Um, the boat's got uh, a diesel heating system. It's got a solid fuel um, burner. Um, it's got microwave. It's got a fridge. It's got um, the usual, you know, uh, a grill um, and the oven. They're high up, so built in. And the uh, hubs are on the work surface. So yeah, I quite I quite like that. Um, 
Only thing what's not in there is a table, but that's not an issue. I have, I'm going to take uh, maybe the little fold-up table I've got in the kitchen. Uh, and I've also got these um, disabled things what slide under the bed and that, you know, what allow you to to um, work away on your things. They, they've got different angles and that. I've got, we've got two of those here, so um, we'll see about those. They can always be dismantled and put away, so um, it's worth taking those. Because I need work to do for my... I need something to to be able to do my art if I want to do some watercolour. Not that I'm any good at watercolour, but I want to learn. I'm a more of an acrylic oil and um, Indian ink and pen, but um, I've switched over to digital for a lot. Also, when I was buying this boat, I wanted to make sure that there was suitable positions for me to put a camera to do my vlogging. Oh, lady's getting excited. She's licking herself now. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I wanted to uh, to be able to put the camera somewhere uh, on a surface and that, and uh, it, it's that's all suitable. Uh, not that it's really an issue because I've got several options open to me, and I can always uh, um, put. Just it's not really an issue. Uh, I'm going to explore it. I'm pro I probably might have one or two cameras dotted around different angles. We'll see. Uh, so yeah, I'm really excited and uh, the only thing now is I've got to find somewhere where I can live uh, from the 8th of October for maybe a couple of weeks while the boat is sorted out um, and I've got nowhere yet. I've uh, got to have find somewhere w w where I can stay with Lady and myself. Uh, and, and ideally somewhere where I can just put these um, storage boxes, what I've got. I haven't got a great deal, there's probably, of, um, I don't know how many, I'll probably narrow it down a bit more. Uh, I mean I could, I could keep a load in the car I suppose, but, um, but I still need somewhere to put the others and, and that I haven't got an option for at the minute. Although, I may have, I may have it sorted tomorrow if, fingers crossed, if something goes right in my favour and hopefully it will because things come in three and I had good news yesterday, good news today, so hopefully tomorrow. But I'll fill you in on that on another uh, vlog. So for now then folks, it's uh Good night from me and I uh, hope you enjoy the pictures what I'll add to this video and uh, I hope you uh, are able to follow my YouTube channel, my Twitter, my Instagram. Um, talking about those I just can't believe how many people have uh, subscribing. I, I'm quite uh, you know overwhelmed by it to be honest. I didn't know you know with being a newbie in that uh, you know, whether there would be the interest, you know, and I mean, made it quite clear that I like my technology and photography and nature and stuff and art and uh, looks as though, um, you know, you lot are going to be interested in these different things. A bit of cooking, uh, you'll have to, that that will probably be fun and games because it, uh, I won't be able to have my cooking uh, machines what I use here on the boat. Well I could, if I get the solar fitted in, there would be enough. I would be able to use any device I wanted. Um, so, uh, yeah, but I'm not taking anything with me, I'll just buy new at some point. Um, so that's it then folks, I'm not going to go anymore. Sometimes I can get carried away and uh, I don't uh, I just think things up as I go along. I don't have it all written down on paper. Sometimes I might do, and it has worked out well for me, because sometimes I can't get the words out, sometimes I might forget. Uh, sometimes I get a bit nervous or excited, but uh, I think you can see 
I'm quite excited and excuse the appearance, I've been sweating today. I think it's been a combination of the excitement, a um, bit of heat and uh, yeah, I think that's it. I didn't get much sleep last night either. Uh, so, uh, okay, that's it. Bye folks.